First of all, a soul is not something that you have. It is what you are. Suffering is not good for the soul unless it teaches you how to stop suffering. That is its purpose. You are in physical existence to learn and understand that your energy, translated into feelings, thoughts, and emotions, causes all experience. There are no exceptions. The imagination, backed by great expectations, can bring about almost any reality within the range of probabilities. Your breath changes the atmosphere. Your encounters with others alter the fabrics of their lives and the lives of those who come in contact with them. People die when they are ready to die for reasons that are their own. No person dies without a reason. You are not taught that, however, so people do not recognize their own reasons for dying and they are not taught to recognize their own reasons for living because you are told that life itself is an accident in a cosmic game of chance. People die for a cause only when they have found no cause to live by. You are given the gift of the gods. You create your reality according to your beliefs. Yours is the creative energy that makes your world. There are no limitations to the self except those you believe in. Do not personally give any more conscious consideration, either of you, to events that you do not want to happen. Any such concentration, to whatever degree, ties you in with those probabilities, so concentrate upon what you want, and as far as public events are concerned. Take it for granted that sometimes even men are wiser than they know. You must begin to trust yourself sometimes. I suggest you do it now. If you do not, then you will forever be looking to others to prove your own merit to you, and you will never be satisfied. You will always be asking others what to do, and at the same time resenting those from whom you seek such aid. For at no time are any events predestined. There should be no such word in your vocabulary, for with every moment you change, and every heartbeat is an action, and every action changes every other action. Live every day to its fullest, and do not be a slave to your hopes for the future. If you do not learn to enjoy today, you will not enjoy the future no matter what it may bring. Thank you for watching. If you liked this video, make sure to subscribe for more.